How do you sing? That's not the right lyric. What is it? Volare. It's oh, Italian, gosh. meaning to fly. Oh, I'm so stupid. Well, that's... <laughs> well, I'll be flying after I drink this compadre. <laughs> well, oh, oh, hey, everybody. <laughs> Welcome to How to Feed a Loon. We're flying high. Yay. Yeah. I'm Chris. And I'm Wesley. The, the lyric wrong. Right. I always get my lyric wrong. Loon. <laughs> That's the name of his memoir that he's actually working on. Yeah, there are several. Yeah, there's a lot. There's a lot of working titles. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, I am so excited because you probably noticed there's no food here, which sometimes is a bad thing, but it's a really good thing today because it means you're going to be making That's a cocktail. That's right. Today, if you hadn't noticed, I'm going to make something with Campari, <sighs> and I am going to make an Italian classic cocktail. Mm, it's, I love it. It's called a Negroni. Ooh, that sounds good. Yes, let's do it. Okay. All right. So we've got the Campari, which is a... Um, actually, it's part of the bitters family. Hmm. It's um, Don't be bitter. Yes. It, it's got some herbs and some fruit flavors yeah, in there. Yeah. It's so I good. Love com- I love Campari. And the always... red gives it a... The, the dark red means gives it away as a bitter. Yeah. Don't you love how I just quickly digress when you go into like an Italian restaurant or a bar and you see like the really cool Campari posters yes, that's what, that's I, what I this love. is all about and the martini yes the, the martini these two things so yes. here we go this is classic Italian okay so we're gonna do equal parts well wait a minute and what else have you got here that's what I'm in, that's what I'm oh. about right at the start we're gonna start making the drink without telling me what's in it no I sound like trying to sound like the godfather <laughs> Yeah, well, it's not even close. So, anyway. <laughs> All right, so we got equal parts of Campari. Okay. So, about an ounce and a half, maybe a shot. I'm just going to eyeball it like oh, I normally do. Here we go with the eyeballing. So, that's about a shot. Oh, that was not much of a shot, but okay. <laughs> I love and Campari. Then so delicious. you have a little gin. I love it. I love it. Another shot of gin. That's awesome. Now these are two. This is. I'm excited yeah, about. That. Actually, it's it. funny. This uh, the the story behind this. The story behind this is that uh, this count count Camillo or Camilo or something mm-hmm. uh, Negroni mm-hmm. was at his favorite haunt, whatever it was, drinking establishment, and he wanted something a little stronger than americano. Now, now an americano is just this and club soda. Mm-hmm. So the bartender threw in a little gin, and there you have the birth of the Negroni. Hmm. Okay. Yes. Well, <laughs> certainly took a long time for that ah, story. So well, let's I mean, go ahead. People need to know. No, they just need to know how to make the drink. All right. So, so okay. then you have another equal part of sweet vermouth. Oh, that's sweet. So equal parts this, this, and sweet vermouth. So we've got Campari, Tanqueray, and vermouth. There we go. Okay. Yes, so you put those. No oh. mixers or anything with no, it? No, that's it. Wow. So this is kind Three of Three like pots, a... baby. Three pots. Three like, delicious like, parts. Like soprano, alto, bass. <laughs> <laughs> or mezzo. Or a mezzo. So you shake it in your shaker. Get it, shake get it, it nice and cold. Don't lick it. Don't lick it. Tongue will get stuck to it. Now, you want to... Put your rocks glass right here, and you want to put a big giant ice cube. Now, <laughs> these are so much fun. I didn't have any like ice cube trays for my big giant ice cubes. No. So I took a little Tupperware and I filled it with ice, and now I have a big giant ice cube. It's like a block of ice. It's a big giant ice cube. Everybody it's loves that. I like it. It is. It's it's a conversation starter. Yes. That's for sure. So what you're gonna do is take your cocktail, mm-hmm. take your Negroni, and pour it over the ice. Oh, that's beautiful. It gets nice and chilly on a hot day mm. on the piazza. Mm. Mm. I think I'll go. I think I will, too. <laughs> but I'm going to drink this first. Look at that. So you've got gorgeous. that red hue. I do love that giant ice cube. That's and cool. once again, you just want to use a little more citrus. Oh, okay. Get this. Get some c- citrus oils in there. Sometimes you like to... I light it on fire. You light your f- but I have fruit on fire. <laughs> So many things wrong with that state. Well, we've got enough flame going on. Let's just say that. All right. Okay. That is it. Wow, that is really beautiful. Isn't it gorgeous? That's another gorgeous cocktail. That's I just, an, it's a sipping cocktail. Actually, it's not that strong, I don't think. Well, you it's got me. nothing but alcohol in it. How could it not be? Yeah, that but strong? these are this is more of a I know a it's lower, lower yeah. but still, I mean I thought is there gonna be a mixer in there, but okay. Is, we'll see. It matches your outfit. Thanks.
I love it. Is it a, a favorite now? I love it. I mean, you know, I, I mean, I do. I love a good quality gin, um, but and I don't even really taste the gin that much. This is, this is a. I mean, this is definitely a sipper. You know, you wouldn't sit there, you know throw and. It's wheat. great. A hot day gin is so good on a hot day. Oh my gosh! And I could. I really could imagine having an amazing Italian meal and then finishing it off with this. Oh, this is good, Lorraine. Yay! You did really good. I'm now so happy. that is a loon cocktail. Yeah. Oh. Now you can get this recipe and many more on howtofeedaloon.com. Oh, that is really good. That's really good. I'm excited about that. So be sure to like and share and do all of that fun stuff yes. on social media that all you whippersnappers out there do so well. Because then you're never going to miss another drink like this. You can <laughs> head right into whippersnapper. You know, they're always on their phones <laughs> doing this. <laughs> <you know? laughs> so it's great, though. It's really good because we love yes. to do that, too. So anyway. Yes. Oh, all right, y'all. Cheers. Let's fly away. Amore. Campari. Volare. Volare. I can volare on the sure sea. I like a big pizza pie. That's not a volare. You're a moron. <laughs> Hey! hey. <laughs> now, if you like what you saw, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. That's right. If you get more wonderful Italian recipes, just click right here. Yeah. Right here. Right here. Won't miss a thing. That's right.